Okay, so news has it that um, Brian Laundry is a wanted individual. Now, police have supposedly covered all areas along with the FBI. But, believe it or not, Dog the Bounty Hunter is doing a better job than the cops. And Dog knows exactly where Laundry might be hiding at. Now, I'm going to have a coverage here of Dog the Bounty Hunter speaking of his ideas or knowledge of where he might be. It turns out that the family, the mom and dad, along with Brian, checked in to this resort on September 1st through the 3rd, checked out. They checked back in on the 6th through the 8th. On the 6th, three individuals registered. On the 8th, upon departure, two individuals left. One is unaccounted for, which I believe is Brian. Now, here's footage of Dog the Bounty Hunter speaking about that. Down here in Florida, in Fort DeSoto, it's almost dark. So we had a very good lead come up today that he was down here in this park, not very far away. We checked our lead out. It is confirmed. The parents were down here two times. It was September 1st through the 3rd and September 6th through the 8th. They registered to stay at this park. They were registered, went through the gate. They're on camera. They were here. And they did enter. They did come here. Allegedly, what we're hearing is two people left on the 8th. Three people came in on the 6th. And two people left on the 8th. I think he's been here for sure. So, there's a lot of little islands around the area where we're at that he could get to on a canoe down here in Florida, in Fort DeSoto, it's almost dark. So we had a very good lead come up today that he was down here in this park, not very far away. We checked our lead out, it is confirmed. The parents were down here two times. It was September 1st through the 3rd and September 6th through the 8th. They registered to stay at this park. They were registered, went through the gate, they're on camera they were here and they did enter they did come here allegedly what we're hearing is two people left on the 8th three people came in on the 6th and two people left on the 8th I think he's been here for sure so now dog the bounty hunter is doing much more than the cops as I mentioned before now I'll take you to the neighbors of Brian Laundry, He was uh, then protecting uh, their son, but I think they just took it too far. Um, if, if, if their son was innocent, I don't feel that they should have lawyered up as soon as he came back into the state. Uh, and I felt that if he had nothing to do with it, then they should have released a statement somehow stating his innocence. Um, now, uh, the last time that um, we saw Gabby was uh, right when we moved in in June. Um, they were working on the van, um, um, I guess, to get ready for the trip. We never even knew they were going on a trip, but uh, she was in the back of the van doing something and uh, as we pulled away, she turned, waved, I waved back and she smiled and we drove away. That's the last time we saw her. You know, uh, she was a pretty girl and you know, you see her turn around and just smile and um, you know, knowing that uh, you see the images on their trip of her smiling, um, it is a haunting, uh, was a haunting sight and memory. So again, it appears, as the neighbors were speaking, it appears that the parents are protecting Brian Laundry. They're hiding him. Why? Because he's guilty. My thing is, as they mentioned, if he weren't guilty, make yourself present. Come out and explain where you've been all this time. Or why don't the parents make a statement? 
and to protect him and to hide him. It's two wrongs don't make a right. Um, I find it very, very, uh, no remorse whatsoever. Uh, I feel for the uh, family of Gabby, the Petito family, I feel for them. I feel for the uh, the father, the mother, and the stepfather. Um, this is just something that should have not happened. Uh, this beautiful soul here, Gabby, she will be missed. And she was a beautiful girl. Uh, what I have next is there's a map here that describes um, the, how can I put it, the uh, flight tracker. Let's put it as the flight tracker showing all these planes that are flying around. Uh, in this post here, it says someone just posted a video of the police scanner that Brian Laundry has been found. He's in a rental car waiting for confirmation. Hmm. Well, let's hope and see and hope that this is true and as you know dog the bounty hunter he has got a really hot uh, lead on brian uh laundry laundry in the last 30 minutes now keep in mind this was last night so these there are a few hours say about nine hours after the fact from this uh video and now there are several play, planes circling the everglades so i'm hoping they get this guy i really do Thank you for joining in on this short video. Um, my final thoughts are, I hope they find Brian and Gabby will be placed to rest very soon. Again, my thoughts and prayers go out to the Petito family and the Laundry family. Mom and dad, turn them into the FBI, please. Let's put an end to this. A beautiful soul has been lost. And it does not do any good hiding them. You're only making matters worse. So, please. Thank you guys, everyone, for joining in. And if you have any thoughts or comments, please feel free to leave them down below. Good night.